Hi, I'm Ellie. And I'm Charlotte, and we run a wedding boutique. Today we're going to talk to you about how to plan your wedding. If you're planning a Caribbean wedding, first you need to decide if it's a Caribbean themed wedding or you're actually getting married in the Caribbean. If you're getting married in the Caribbean, you can get some really gorgeous luxury holidays and they tend to sort out everything that you need to do. You just need to worry about what you're going to wear, who you're going to invite um, and organise the flights and how you're going to get everything there. This dress is perfect if you're going to be getting married in the Caribbean because you have to remember it is going to be hot. So it, this is a, a Georgette overlay, so it's really nice and light and it's strapless, you don't have any sleeves, you don't have to worry about sweat patches or anything like that. So again, you really have to consider a light dress and also you are going to be taking it with you on the plane. So again, travelling with the dress, etc. And the same for your bridesmaids and your guests as well. Inform them if you are actually going to be having the ceremony on a beach, maybe they maybe you suggest that they don't wear ties or suit jackets because it will be boiling. And don't forget to pack the suntan lotion. Exactly. The venue will sort out most things for you. So again, you don't really need to worry too much about that. And you'll be in contact with them um, over the internet or by a phone. But most of it will get confirmed a few days before the wedding. Yeah. The other Caribbean wedding you can have is the style of the Caribbean wedding. So rather than getting married in the Caribbean, it's about everything sort of encompassing the Caribbean theme. So steel band, jerk chicken, vibrance, Energetic, car yeah, carnival festival, sort of feel. Yeah. So you probably wouldn't wear a dress like this. You would sort of go more sort of over the top, um, opulent sort of style of dress, I would think. Yeah, and I think it is, again, you can decide how far you want to take it. It might be because, you you're marrying into a Caribbean family or you are Caribbean or it's just very close to both of you and you want to embrace the Caribbean atmosphere. I mean, the, the carnival essence of it and the colours are fantastic. You know, really bright and vibrant and the energy that they, you know, the steel band, band bring and everything. It could be that you just really love steel bands and that's the only essence. You don't have to go the whole hog. I think it's all about picking and choosing. It's all about working out how much of it you want to embrace the Caribbean theme of the wedding really. And that's how you plan a Caribbean wedding.